All right, so I was just at a fragrance store and I saw this and I've been told over and over I should get this, so I'm gonna unbox it. Let's see, I probably should have gotten scissors. Just realizing that it's like those pull tab type things. Ooh, let's see if this works. I'm sorry, Apple, I know I'm not supposed to use this for this, but hopefully I don't mess up the end of this. Because I did not think about this when I decided I was gonna unbox this. Ooh, almost, almost. See if I can. Oh, I'm like, I'm alone. I love you to death, but can you not make this easier for a bro without fingers to open? Just saying. Just saying. Oh, actually, excited. This is my second only Michael Malone fragrance. I have the Gent Sense collection. I'm missing one of the five, but I have the other four. So I do have Jet Black Reserve, which I personally love that one. Everyone says I should get um the other ones but if i'm honest i think jet black reserves the best one it works on my skin projects well good performance i'm doing a terrible job at this oh my goodness gracious me it'll be interesting to see if i leave all this on the video or if i cut it a lot of times i cut or speed up this stuff because it's just boring i think like who wants to see some dude with that hand struggle to open something there we go there we go all right i got one of them and that's like my hand i'll put you right there Boop. now what i'm hopeful for is i can just slide out the side of the box i don't have to do the other side because that was too much work and it is not working. Ah, oh, darn it. Don't make me do this. Please don't make me do this. Man. <sighs> All right. Back to work. I'm literally just pushing this down. Everyone's gonna be like, why don't you breed scissors? Why don't you do a knife? I'm thinking the same thing. There we go. Is that enough that I can peel this off? There we go. There we go. I'll put you right there. All right. There's the lid. There's the bottle. Look at that. That looks pretty cool. Michael Malo, way to go on presentation. Check that bottle out. Ooh. Ooh, I really like this bottle. It is a EDP, 100 mil. I hope I like this. I'm gonna spray it on the front of the box. Check out this atomizer. Come on, son, get it. Uh-oh. Smells really good. It is very fresh. Oh shoot. Okay, I'm clean. <sighs> Let that dry for a second so I don't get hit with alcohol. That smells good. It smells very similar to Dylan Blue, though. It's like Elysium and Dylan Blue together, in my opinion. Oh, that smells so good. I can totally see myself rocking this. Let's see. I think the notes are on the back. No, just... Oh, yeah, I guess it is, but it's a lot of uh, old or notes. I do not know what that means. Sorry. Sorry, Michael Malone. Oh, this is so nice. I'm digging this. I'm di <laughs> the foam came out. That's funny. That's funny. It looks like they cut out the bottom of it right down there. So that was moving. Oh. So again, this is just first impressions. I don't know how long it lasts. I don't know how well it projects. I don't know sillage. I don't know any of that good information, but for initial impressions, I'm really, really, really digging it. Again, to me, it smells like um, Dylan Blue with a hint of like Elysium. Like, I, I love this. I love this. This is definitely up my alley. Now, I will say, once we figure out how it performs projects, that will determine, you know, whether I recommend it or, you know, price-wise, all that good stuff. So, so far, this feels like a good fragrance. Again, there should be a follow-up video in the near future or future. We'll see where I'll talk more about this, or maybe I'll make a list and I'll talk about it there. So just keep your eyes out on the channel. Again, I'm on TikTok and YouTube. 
Uh, YouTube is growing greatly. So thank you so much for all the help, all the subscribers, all the follows. You're helping me out a ton. So anyhow, this is Nub Experience. I'll talk to you soon.